house the last couple of days. It's pretty damn crazy. When I came out to Toronto, I, 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 I didn't even really go there for a show. I, I didn't really want to perform. I just wanted to be around my family. I haven't been to Canada in like six months. So when I got out there, I just fucking snapped. <laughs> I was like, fuck it. We are in the middle of dick shit nowhere. We don't know where the fuck we are. Where are we? Indiana or Indiana, something? Bro. We're Indiana, pretty much bro. in the middle of dick shit nowhere. Places. And uh, we're almost at the border. <laughs> so we all got to smoke all of this fucking weed before we get to the border. Because we was not about to throw this shit. <laughs> Twelve seconds later. Oh, I don't know. Josh is gonna go inside and eat all the food in the RV. <laughs> Boston was fucking retarded. Me? I'm coming for every single one of these kids. I'm coming to make them all citizens. To change whatever lifestyle they were living into the right lifestyle. Swaggy lifestyle. I've never been on tour this long in my life. It's probably one of the first experiences, man, you know. Coming from someone like G Easy and watching him do his thing is like, you know, it's a blessing to be able to watch it and see how far niggas came. We went out to Vermont. First time we was in like a very, very, very tight part of this venue called the higher grounds and uh, I remember last time we had performed there uh, we had looked at the other side and the other side was so huge and seemed so big to us at the time a year and a half later we're at the same spot selling it out like damn it really was that big it's crazy The rest of this tour, I can't fucking wait for the rest of this tour. Cause these things happen, they really fucking happen. It's fucked up, but I got to keep that heater cooking now. Can somebody tell me what's the reason for these trick answers? When my chick answers talking about she left my crib and fences.